learning in third standard young kid today my topic is a good house a good house should be airy and varied a house should have open space like veranda or a country yard this gives us fresh air and sunlight and a place to play in doors and windows should be lighted wire netting to keep flies and mosquitoes away a house should have a well planted drain system that carries dirty water away from the house thank you very much so oh, friends my name is antra yavle today my project is about animal care and their feeding habits elephant has a long trunk and a short tail it likes to eat it uses its trunk to eat and to drink giraffe giraffe has a long neck it likes to eat leaves tiger eats flesh like deer cows and other herbivores hmm. cows buffaloes horses are domestic animals it 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 is also known as herbivores they eat grass crops leaves etc cows cows house is called shed horse house is called a shelter Hello me today is my topic is a good house a good house a good house the path the the houses are built by many skilled workers our house keeps us safe from the heat of the sun the cold the the rain and the storm The rooms in a house should be airy and wide. A house should have open space like veranda like a veranda or a country yard. The house is a the house is a building. A house is a building that is that is made for people to live in i love my house very much thank you very much hello everyone my name is kalpesh today my topic is a good house this is my good house it it is neat and clean near my good house it is the road and bushes on the road there is coconut tree Near my house, there is a garden. In garden, the swimming pool is there. We bath. We bath in the swimming pool. There are windows and doors in my house. The fresh air come in the house. I keep care and neat and tidy my house. I keep clean and neat. my house then thank you very much ladies and gentlemen today i am very happy to stand before you today my topic is a good house a good a house should be airy and well it a wide electric system works in my house doors and windows should be filled with weather needed to keep wet and mosquitoes away a house should have a well planted system that carries dirty water away from the house thank you very much
Satish Ingle. I am studying in third standard section Yankee. This is my house. This is the ground floor. This is the courtyard. The window is so big that the fresh air air comes inside the house. There are some trees planted in the courtyard. This is the first floor. The balcony is has much place. So we enjoy the sunlight and fresh air. The roof is red but the sides are grey and yellow. The color is so bright. Thank you very much. Hello and hearty good morning to respected teachers and all students. Myself, Vitanshu Vijay Tobar, CBC 3rd, Yankee. Today my subject is Science Exhibition, A Good House. A good house should have a, a airy and well lit. It should, it should ha have a harvesting system also. Harvesting system means the rainwater the rainwater comes on the terrace of the house and that water goes to our tank and that tank gives water to our plants, herbs, bushes and other etc. It it has a pipe that give, that we can use it to wash cars and other and other things. It it has a pipe that gives water into the house and that water we use to we use that water to bath to take a bath to wash clothes to wash plates and etc birds also come to drink water here like this the harvesting system works This water is going into the house, but here the water is not coming. Like this, the harvesting system works. This is a good house should have a lawn also that lawn the, the trees give in the lawn it the lawn has should have a, so should have so many trees herbs and bushes because herbs bushes and trees gives us oxygen it, and that's why our house become airy and well lit thank you very much we are going to our new farm Now I will tell you about my new farm. There are six animals in my farm. Cow, bull, horse, sheep, goat, donkey. We must clean our shelter twice in a week. We must give a bath to all the animals. We must grow more and more trees for fresh air. We have separate water tubs and grass tub of my animals. We give vaccine, medicines as per my animals' requirement. We call vet 
for checkup. Hello everybody, my name is Rishti Nilesh Kariskar. I am in 3rd standard section 5. Today my topic is bird and their shelters. Baby birds are born in nest. All animals, re all birds reproduce by laying eggs. When they have to lay eggs, they build house called nest. Dif any birds use different different material to make their nests. Bird build nest to lay eggs. They choose place where which are safe from any and bad weather. Bird use material like twins, dry leaves, cotton, turf, wool, feather and feather hair, piece of cloth, paper and pebbles, pebbles to build their nest. They the nest. The eggs are laid in the nest. After some time, the eggs hatch and baby birds come out. When the baby birds are big, young, they fly away. Most parents bird, most parent birds are also live in nest. They build new nest when they have to lay eggs again thank you very much hello my name is adarsh pramod sarab third wife science exhibition the name of science exhibition is bird and their shelters this is pigeon this is sparrow they are eating them this is Rio. He lives in forest. This is Swan. This is Eagle. This is Fishing. This is Peacock. He is our national bird. This is Parrot. He eats grains and nuts. This is Vulture. He eats flesh. They eat He eat flesh. This is crow. This is owl. He is attractive at night. This is also parrot. This is nest. A bird. This is bird of wearing bird. This nest of waving bird and this is waving bird this is tailor bird's nest thank you very much sorry these are penguin left this live in snow and this is penguin's nest it is made by stones and pebbles Thank you very much. Thank you very much. Hello everyone. My name is Siddhesh Nilesh Zumbari. I study in third class section Y. I am presenting my science project. The name of my project is The Birds, The Bird and Their Shelters. All birds build nest to lay eggs. They choose safe place. They choose safe place from bad weather. Some birds like Woodpecker, it uses its beak to make hole and a tree trunk. Now next is hen, a, cook, a, a chicken coop a, a, or, or hen house is very small for lay eggs. Now next is ostrich bird, now next is ostrich bird, they live in hot or dry places. He cannot fly, but he can run fast. Now next is penguin. The penguins live the penguin lived in cold area. He cannot fly. Now next is peacock. Yeah, 
it is our national bird Pe peacocks are ground feeders that eats small small insects uh, plants and small creatures now next is duck the duck lives in water it has flat and broad beak now next is tailor bird and his nest the the tailor bird use its beak like a needle to save leaves with materials dry like dry or green or green grass now next is weaver bird the weaver the weaver bird the we, the weaver bird made made strong and beautiful nest they they enter through a tunnel opening at the bottom this is my science project hope you like it thank you very much